Now the question is how much transparency can you provide, right? And uh, and typically you don't you don't provide uh, information. I mean, the guidelines I should say the clinical guidelines recommend that uh, you don't disclose patient level information and also you don't disclose much information at all because you could compromise the study. So that's basically what is the, the background from, from the guidelines viewpoint. Now we are actually looking at uh, how much transparency can we provide considering we are in a very special set of circumstances, of course. So we've provided, uh, we've disclosed our protocol and we are looking, we're discussing with other companies as an industry, what kind of transparency could we offer uh, without compromising patient privacy, of course, but also without uh, compromising uh, the, the trial itself.